Good, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I am very hungover. What happened to your kneecap? Uh, there was a swing dancing maneuver oh, with a right. very tall person. Oh, did I push you over? Well, it was like <laughs> you gracefully s s flung me into the fire, <laughs> in, into a rock or a cactus or something. It's okay. Very bloody. There was there was a lot of dancing around a fire last night, and if you don't know this about me, I'm a big, tall, white guy, so I can't dance at all. And when I do, people get hurt. <laughs> And that's what happened. Um, we're, we're, I think, reached the level of hungover at this point where we don't quite feel like making breakfast. So we're going to drive into town and score some burgers. Yes. Yes, indeed. Because I'm a master of my own destiny and I'll do what the fuck I want. There's enough water for me to swim in. I will jog my happy ass back down to that water. All your anxiety. All of your pain, all of your worries, nag at your brain. Okay, I'm gonna sit here. This rock is just annoying to watch. Yeah. <laughs> Can't keep me with you. It's okay. But the good part about this rock is. And the fact that I was. In spite of all of your sadness. Still gotta try Still gotta try Still gotta try Still gotta try All of your dreams collide You can't face the day Apparently Brian likes to torture me and uh, now the plan is to go to this river and check this stuff out before food You know, there's a very like important hierarchy of events that happen when you're hungover Food's pretty high up there and Going swimming in a river, not so high up there It looks cool though, let's check it out You still gotta try Still gotta try Still gotta try Still gotta try This is this? Uh, you can bring well, this right here? Yeah, hamburgers. Right here. Hamburgers are down there. I okay. Nearby. Yeah, fish. Okay. Still gotta try. Still gotta try. Time to hit the road, time to get back out there because I am starving. The longer I gotta go and I hang over without food, the crankier I get. Let's get some food quick before I turn into a big green monster. Carolina, got your moon shining in the mountain. Back in the field, driving clear, clean water. And you got near me, Carolina. Guy could get tougher till the Charles and Bay. Welcome to the beautiful scenic town of Sedona, where we will get burgers and we will feel a lot better. It's just gorgeous here, and the sun's out. <sighs> Feeling better already. Some of you guys like to give me a hard time, you know, if I drink on the videos or uh, 
I'm hungover and stuff, but let's 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 put this in perspective, okay? This was a bit of a celebration. We had everyone out, the big crew from Phoenix were all out in Sedona. It's gorgeous, it's beautiful. That was Mark's last night in the van because he's leaving tonight. You know, celebration. And after a good celebration, it is appropriate to feel a little ill. Time for some burgers. <laughs> Sedona is like the capital of new age, crystal, energy, healing power, guru stuff. So uh, it's said that Sedona has these vortexes, which is uh, like a new age hippie kind of, you know, m magic healing force, crystal kind of stuff. So we're, we're gonna keep our eyes out for the healing forces of Sedona. You guys are waiting for us? How's it going? Hey. Good. Oh, you can put it, but yeah, no, you don't wear it. Can't wait. Wow. Look at that view out the window, eh? Thank you. You like that. Just give me a buck and I'll share something with you. Hey, what do you think about all this vortex stuff though? You believe it? Yeah. You're a believer in the vortex? Yeah, I'm a believer. Okay. Healing properties, or what do you think? Um, are you loving love your one? Do you believe yeah. in the vortex stuff, Jessica? Uh, maybe. Okay. Kind of like a weird little spiritual nature thing. I, be I believe in the. I knew a woman who she would take close friends to the vortex, and she said that she could connect with aliens. Like these tiny gray skinny men and she has these crazy stories and she's like 75 years old but super healthy it's really weird <laughs> i don't know about the uh spiritual nature of the vortexes here but i, I can, believe in I, the power of you and me i can attest to the spiritual healing power of that burger it was amazing uh, Growth hormones are the best. <laughs> Growth hormones are the best hormones. Feeling spiritually enlightened? No, because I haven't been to the vortex yet. All right, well, let's go do that then. <laughs> I, feel, I feel pretty aligned. You feel different, changed? I just, I know. I, I noticed a distinct lack of levitating. I, I really felt there. like I shouldn't be in that store because I felt like I was going to break everything in there. Uh, Same what did you buy? Yeah. <laughs> you got some Merkaba? Oh, did you buy anything? Yeah, well, I didn't... Like that. Oh, yeah, that's crazy. The shape. <laughs> yep. What's this supposed to do for you? Uh, well, it depends on the rock, but... One of them's like good luck, and the other one's supposed to like help health, heart, kidney. Yeah. So, good All luck and organs. healthy kidneys. Yeah. Organs, so the healthy kidneys is nice because you drank your face off yesterday. So yeah, I'm gonna need that. It's good. Driving down on 85, listen to the country play. Carolina, Carolina, I'm heading home. 
Welcome to Montezuma's Well. Kind of like uh, Jacob's Well that we saw up in Texas, but it's in Arizona and it's our last stop here in Sedona. So do a little hike, check this out. And then we're gonna make our way back down to Tempe to Phoenix and drop Mark off. <sighs> Sad to see him go already. What's in blue skies? kind of cool actually the water comes up um, from the ground table after being what is it, 10 thousand years it, it takes the water to cycle through here and it forces up through these vents at the bottom and this pool just keeps going deeper and deeper and it's super dark down there there's no fish and there's a lot of freshwater leeches kind of a terrifying place really it's nothing like Jacob's well at all okay Just the heartache, not just the pain. It's the everyday living you want 
wanna feel once again.